Yo, here's an interesting way to tune a sound. So what we have on one track is a saw wave. And in one track, a weird kind of mess that I made by just reversing and time stretching a drum break. And what I want to do is use a spectral compressor to tune this to the note of the saw wave. And then of course we could also just use a synth on the saw wave channel. Just important that we output a kind of saw audio. So essentially what we're going to be doing is we're going to sidechain this. Select the sidechain input. And audio 10. And then we're going to set this spectral compressor here to the uh, sidechain mode. Basically, exactly sidechain matching here. And then let's just listen what it sounds like now. And then just turn the ratios up. Turn the window size up. Window overlap down. Attack and release up. And you can hear how it kind of forces this into the shape of the harmonics of the saw. So now we can kind of mess with this, make this more or less extreme. So we're kind of using the harmonic profile of the saw wave here to resonate the sound. Let's maybe just look at the spectrum analyzer of the two next to each other and I think it'll be kind of interesting. So basically what you'll see in orange is the saw wave and then what you'll see in, in blue is the this sound here. So you can kind of see how it's made to like approximate um, the harmonic profile of the saw wave and now we can kind of blend with this or we can tune some other sounds or we could for example um, turn this track into a hybrid track um, or even a no no let's turn this into an instrument track um, let's use a polymer and kind of create our saw waves this way and then we'll be able to kind of play the saw wave which would be kind of cool so i have my midi here i just make sure this is getting midi so we can hear. And I have my track here, so I can kind of play the resonance of this. Uh, let's maybe turn it up a bit and saturate it a bit. And this way we kind of can create interesting bases. Of course, we can also play chords. All sorts of fun to be had with this by using this a spectral compressor with a high window size and sidechain matching mode and using a tone basically saw waves tend to work best um, because they have all the harmonics um, as a kind of sidechain source and then just tuning any old drum break maybe we can also let's just draw something in here and try some other sound that we can put here instead of this drum break let's just put like an f f0 and then no. Uh, G G sharp zero, and just loop this and put some other sounds through this just to hear what it sounds like.
think you get the idea. Lots of stuff to explore for yourself. A spectral compressor, by the way, free plugin, in case you didn't know. But you've, you've seen this plugin. Let's be real. You all know this plugin. Um, or maybe you don't. No, no shame if you don't. But most, most people have seen this probably. So yeah, cheers. Bye.